gone shopping. I'll pick the kids up from school at lunchtime, and then I'll come home to get things ready for Jason's birthday party. Don't work too hard. I love you. I better take a shower and get dressed before I go downstairs. I'm as clean as a whistle. Time to get dressed.
Nothing like a refreshing shower. I almost feel awake. I've got some time before Grace and the kids get back. Better get some work done.
Hey, yeah. take it easy. You're gonna knock me over. Uh, so this is your big day, huh? Am I grown up now? Hmm, ten years old. That's not exactly grown up, but you're getting there. Now, can I drive your car? And I think you're gonna have to wait a little while for that. <laughs> Ethan, can you please help me? I'm coming. I've been so excited since this morning. I could hardly keep them in line in the supermarket. How's your day been? Managed to get any work done? Uh, not really. I tried, but I didn't really nail it. I hope I get inspired because we're supposed to be presenting the plans to the clients next month. Ugh, oh, I've got a billion things to do. It'll never be ready before Jason's pals arrive. Can you please help me? Uh, there should be plates in the living room cupboard. No problem, leave it to me. I thought you brought that for the kids. Of course, I'm just checking that it still works. Yeah, sure. Hey, Ethan, I thought I asked you to take care of the plates. I forgot, they're in the living room cupboard, right? <laughs> yeah, they haven't moved since last time I asked. I don't know if I've already told you this today, Mrs. Mars, but I find you very attractive. You're not so bad yourself, Mr. Mars. I know what's on your mind, Ethan. But now is not the right time for it. Shame. I've really got to focus on this party. We'll continue this little conversation later. When are Jason's friends coming? Oh, uh, about 2 p.m. Oh, God, I hope I'll be able to keep the situation under control. Not like last year. Jason looks happy. Yeah, it's hard to believe he's 10 years old today. It seems like only yesterday we were flirting in high school. We're getting old, Ethan. Did you find the present for Jason? Yeah, I uh, picked it up from the store this morning. Oh, we were lucky. It was the last one in stock. Sticking. Give it a big tug. That's the set my mother gave us. Be careful, okay? Don't worry. I wouldn't want to be responsible for a diplomatic incident with your mother. Hey, Ethan, you said you were going to be careful. I'm sorry. I'll be more gentle.
Nice day outside. Maybe I could squeeze in a little garden time. I think I'll go outside and play with the kids. Can I do anything to help? No thanks. I should be able to manage. That's it, I'm free as a bird. Hey, five minutes, boys, okay? After that, we've got to eat, because your friends are going to be here okay, soon. Okay, we promise, Mom. Who wants to go first? Me first! No, me, me first. first! Easy, fellas. You can both have a turn. Me first! Me first! No, me first! Okay, Sean, get ready. Here we go. Sean? Lunch is ready. I'll go get him. Sean? 
What's up? It's Merlin. He's dead. He's dead and it's all my fault. No, it's not, Sean. Of course it's not your fault. I'd give anything if you could come back to life. You know, Sean, there's some things which just have to happen. Even if you don't want them to. It's not fair, Dad. It's not fair. 